Hi gang, welcome back to Bigger Smooth, our playthrough, our let's play of uh, City Skylines 2 here. You can see I've actually gone ahead and fixed up some of these intersections uh, for the roundabout. Well, we've got it started, we've got half of it done because the other half of the roundabout isn't actually going anywhere. So this is where we're at and this is what I was talking about last time, getting these, um, these uh, lines in, getting everything sectioned off so the traffic knows which way it actually has to go from which lane. So I think you'll find that uh, I, I like it. It comes up really nicely. It looks a little bit realistic. It's, it's got that element of realism to it. The other thing is um, a lot of crosswalks here that I, I kind of actually want to get rid of, to be honest. Now, I don't mind people walking on the outside of a roundabout. I would prefer them walking down these roads here. Uh, however, do I really... I guess it doesn't matter. I just like having the zebra crossings minimized uh, and foot traffic has to either get public transport or not, which we have to look at putting in at some point in the future. Now, uh, we've got a few uh, amenities and stuff to put in today. We uh, we need to get a high school in. We've got to get a, a, a graveyard in. We've got to get uh, probably a recycling plant and some other stuff like that. Uh, just to keep uh, our progress going. We've got some money bolstered up here to get some of these products in. However, we don't want to just bish and bosh them in and rinse the budget as we go. Let's do a couple of um, checks here now. We want to make sure that electricity is probably going to need a, uh, a power. Did we put two power plants in last time? Yeah, we did. Ha. Huh. And we're still getting rinsed a little bit in electricity, are we? Yeah, here we are. Well, we shouldn't be, but okay, whatever. Water's still looking fine, okay, for the moment. Uh, I'll leave it. I What I wouldn't mind is potentially a recycling center. This uh, this landfill here is 64% full. If we can reduce the amount that takes by putting in a recycling center, it's going to help. The, the thing with the recycling center later on too is it can make products, right? Recycling center is where garbage is produced. Uh, in the city goes uh, the facility recycles the waste and produces raw materials from it. Okay, so we can actually uh, Do something with that I guess for it to help out with our uh, industry area and our factories Which might help out down the track right? Uh, let me just turn down Some lighting here. I think the intensity is just a touch too high. We can go to like 1.9 Right, that's nice. Okay. Ah, oh, isn't that nice? Right. Um, and you can see here we've got uh, we've got a death here. Uh, a dead person is waiting for transport. Right. That's not going to go anywhere. We don't have a funeral home. We don't have a graveyard. <laughs> I don't know why I had to sound like that. We also have um, this estate that's being started to be fenced off. You can see here I've started to really fence it off all through here. Uh, and um, close off this business district before we get to that. I've just got it paused here I want to fix up this intersection here. I started doing some little stuff on if I just click on that I kind of want to get rid of some of these zebra crossings to be honest. I don't know which ones are which that one there That's perfect um, So we're keeping these roundabout ones. That's right. So minimize the uh, crossings there. I Suppose we'll put a crossing there. What I might do is I might get the mod that allows you to put uh, foot traffic over roadways to minimize how much is actually going to step across the road itself. Uh, I think that'll be fine for that. I probably want to do the same here, to be honest. And I'm probably um, going to. So let's see. Are you are you that one? Yes. Okay, cool. Right. Just uh, if people want to walk around up here, they can do it up there. I don't know how they're going to go. They, they obviously have to come this way all the way down here. I don't know get some public transport or something. You know what I mean? I might even take that out too We'll just go around and do all of this. I think also can I square that up a bit? Yeah, that looks much nicer uh, And you are that one. Yes, okay cool Yeah, okay groovy that's just cleaned up those two intersections really nicely now the way they're they're sort of spread out I'm not going to touch that one. I'm going to leave it. It has ended up wobbling our road just here a little bit. Okay. Cool. Now, we have to look at uh, a funeral home, right? I We have this, like, if, if you think this road right here is probably going to run... Uh, now, let's have a look here. Medium road. It's probably going to run straight down here as a bit of a main road, which... Uh, 
we've got it'll, it'll probably go underneath our main freeway that's going to run through that way and it's still a main road that can go out that way with lots of little um sections and stuff coming off it right so i could i, I guess i could bosh it in now and i kind of want it to run like that way right and knowing that our estates are just here so they're far enough away now we've got a we've got a very steepish kind of hill here I'm going to put the um, graveyard just in here. Well, I know it sounds a little bit wrong, but we uh, I may... Hmm, here's the thing. We've got a primary school there, and we've got a primary school there. We may put the high school in on this corner. I kind of want to keep... I don't want things, like, overcrowding in the gap areas. I want to keep those for, like, treeing up and that sort of stuff. I mean, there's sections down here we could go. A high school could even go out here or we put in a high school up in this corner there's still a bit more estate here that we could utilize for ourselves anyway I, I like to sort of sort of tell you what's going on in my mind a little bit too for the moment I think we because what we'll do is we might actually get uh, a graveyard in here with a funeral home and a uh, and um, maybe the retirement <laughs> that sounds rough but the retirement village with it and we might make this all sort of retirement village funeral home crematorium yeah I know that sounds rough but if we can keep it all in the sort of one area for this district it might just bode well for us so uh, if that's the case I'm not gonna link it directly to this road we might actually end up just coming off that road there now this is our one-way street but uh, just if you come around for me like that now the good thing with this game compared to Transport Fever 2 is the AI is just not going to go, oh, and I'll, I'm just, I'll just put a connection there and ruin it, ruin your day, basically. They're not going to do that. Right. The other thing is I'm going to lend myself to sending a road underneath this one over to this side, right? So there, there'll be a connection underneath this main road. Uh, and I think that, uh, you know, that'll start to make the place look really, I don't know, kind of cool. So if we go to medical here, we've got uh, elder care, we've got uh, child health care, which is probably not a bad one to look at too. They're all they are they are all quite expensive though. Uh, if you look at the child health care, is 500 bucks a week upkeep, uh, 600 for the elder care, and uh, 160 just for the crematorium. So we'll we'll start off with the crematorium to begin. Uh, I wonder if we should even we might be able to look. I'll get it in right and then we'll move things around because you can see how much it's uh, not yeah that's how I want to do it I want it down sunken in the ground level and I'm actually going to cut the road in alongside it yeah that's perfect so I'm actually gonna move you like, the crematorium can sit a bit more like that you know we can tree up around it and make things look nice uh, I can also get my road like that a little bit more I might even just pull it back, keep it pulled back here like that. I'm actually going to do the little cul-de-sac trick that we did not long ago. We've got a nice little driveway there. I'm really happy with that. Uh, we need our little node grabber. Uh, we get this one. We get the little plus symbol. We put it about here. Then we get this one. Click on that. Then we go more options, 100%. Let's go like 190. Yeah, okay. That's uh, that'll do that. Then we'll uh, then we'll get this. And we'll just stretch that out a little bit like that, okay? Yeah. Okay. And then we get ourselves a nice little cul-de-sac on the end there. We can sort of potentially maybe even fence stuff off that way. We might even put a pathway. Uh, that's not a bad idea actually. A bit of a pathway through here. Um We'll keep it with the uh, regular path. How do I want it? I might run it up this outside like this. Can I have it so it doesn't snap, please? Yeah, thanks. That's good. Right, and there's a, there's a bit of a zebra crossing up here. A four-way zebra crossing that you can sort out there. Yeah, and that, uh, that now allows the foot traffic, right? That allows that foot traffic to sort of cut through that way and down into the streets if it wants. Yeah, I think that's okay. 
Maybe we'll do some like tree lining stuff there as well. Right. Get it kind of good. We'll, we'll sort of, as we go, we'll, we'll fix things up and come back and clean it up. But for the moment, we know that that's where that goes. Uh, okay, and then, so that looks a bit horrendous. I get it at the moment. But what we would do, I want to kind of get a street that comes um, from here. Like that way. However, I need you, buddy to come down level with me. I need you to level with me, man. I don't know exactly how... Well, you can actually come down a touch deeper, I think. And you can come down a little bit further. So, like, even there. Because we are going to take you under. Oh, we're going to take you under, all right. Uh, can we get you potentially like that? Yeah, that makes me touch up here. Just nicely square along that road. You can curve that footpath there. And how we're we looking, that's pretty good. That's not too bad. Yeah, I'd say pretty good. Uh, we might have a little bit of work to do. We might have to dip down the road. Right, so we go like that. Uh, give me the straight one, please. Right, so that's what it looks like like that. However, we know that we can fix this with our tool. This one, uh, we want uh, elevated, that one. Right, so we know that's that. Very, very low. We could put a dip in it. I don't want any zebra crossings on that. Uh, yeah, that's not what I want. You can actually pull that like that, just to stretch that out a little bit. Okay, shorten that bridge up too. That might be all. that might be better just to shorten this bridge up. Right, keep that bridge nice and short for us. That's not really helping our road lines, though, is it? <laughs> it really isn't. Uh, I think it's this one. No, it, uh, is it? Yeah, uh, no. Right. Think. Huh, I forget. I'll come back. I'll probably like I did with um with these. Much like I did with these here. I might paint in the lines to fix to join these back up. Uh will I do it now? Do you, you you probably don't want to see it now, do you? Look, we'll we'll give it a look, right? So um Say we want to go from there, just to keep this, right? Ah, uh, you can put, there you go. We're actually not going to go, we'll go double solid, right, to marry up with that. Then we could just go like this, like that, that, and that, right? Just to keep it all tickety-boo. Okay, cool. And then we want this one, same again. Uh, well, what do we want to do? We'll go like this. Uh, how do we want to do that? I think we want points here, don't we? No, what did I do for this one? Um, just get rid of that for me. Get rid of that one. Yeah, okay. I think what I do is I go lines. All right, well, we'll do it this way. Okay, we'll make you solid. Uh, what do I want? Uh, no, this is not how I did this. Add node marker. How do I do this? 
Villas, that's what I want. So yeah, something like that, that's what I'm after. I, I probably will go back, I'll go back and fix it all up. So I can get my, uh, so I can get my outlines there as well. I'll do all that myself down the track and play with that. But at least you get an idea that you can clean it up and make it all look like it's, uh, it's prim and proper and back in place. And I can probably widen up that double line to match as well. Uh, you can even put arrows in and that sort of stuff. You can, uh, you know, it's a really good mod, great mod. So yeah, anyway, I'm, I'm kind of actually happy with that, to be honest. I'm actually pretty happy with that. As for this here, less happy. We need, we kind of need a car to go under there. But I, I can tell straight off the bat that it uh, it is it is not uh, low enough. Basically, what what I might do is I might actually add a node in. You can add these nodes, right? So if we add one either side of the bridge, so we we'll add one there, and we'll add one there. Okay. And then what we'll do is I'll go I'll go down one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, so I'm just gonna keep it. There's better ways to do this, but for me, I'm a simpleton. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, and I'm gonna keep it as simple as that for the moment, All right? I don't think that's... It's left a lump and a bump and a hump in the middle because there's obviously a node underneath the middle. That I can't get to. Ah, oh, there it is. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now, uh, if you don't want to do that, I'm pretty sure you just get your you get your tool here. You go from there to there. And you hit enter. And it, level, <laughs> it levels it out anyway. Right? As simple as that. We'll leave that for the moment, but you get the idea of what, what I'm going for here. Okay? Click out of all of that. And basically then what we do is we go bish bash bosh, get some nice lovely trees. Can I get like a group of trees? Is that a thing? I, I can't remember if you can get like a group of trees or not. You know, we could even do something cool like the old palms all the way along up here. Bit of a nice sort of suburb area and then um, crank in a heap of uh, these trees in and around here. Right. Bit like that, bit of like a sort of parky area. Get some of these in, mix up the, the color, the texture. Right, you get that. Well, we can barrier off that, and then you get this kind of nice effect down in here, a little cul de sac. That's where the uh, graveyard is for this uh, town. And then we hit play, and we should see a hearse come out of here and go and collect that body. And any minute, any minute now, any minute, any minute. Uh, time go faster go faster. There we go <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much All right, we could even give this a fun name like um, uh, um what, what we call it we could call it like death row or something, you know <laughs> Death welcome to death row and uh, it's a bit morbid, but uh, you get what I mean uh, Anyway, so that's what I had in mind for there and then what we can do is we can can bring you up and like like we've got here with the actual um, sort of you, you I would call this the uh, the sort of local area CBD whereas it's not going to be the big town it's just light commercial and we could do a little bit more light commercial in and around here to follow that same uh, scene through there and bring this road up into it and then you've got sort of nice little connections in and around town. I kind of want to keep the um, estates separated, so I might even fence that off around the back there and have the road come up. But for the time being, I think that's pretty good how we're going to have that. Money-wise, we're still looking okay. Okay, pretty much looking okay. Uh, electricity, let's just double check that. We're at 71 of 112. We do have the ability to crank the budget up, though, too, remember. Let's bosh in a few more um, roads. Or housing estate. I'm going to keep it straight here. I'm going to keep it um, pretty straight. I want actually, I wouldn't mind. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Straight off there for me, please. I need to have that. I need to have snapped. I'm going to have this area here like this. Probably a shorter road there, and then that. Yeah, okay, that's fine. 
Um, I. It seems a bit odd having it like that, but we're going to leave it like that. I will, however. Well, no, because that's like an entrance and exit street, so I don't want exactly houses on it. Much like this one. It seems like we've got a far enough gap between that road, uh, between that road, that road. Now I'm going to leave it. Okay, there's a there's a road connection there. It's it is only a one way though. Ah, oh, so it is. One way in, one way out. I'm going to leave it one way in, one way out. It's got these little roads in here that people want to travel a different way. Uh, not to mention the fact they do have the ability. You know what we'll do? Okay, I've got a better idea. We'll upgrade these roads to be regular so that the one-way traffic is literally one way like that. Yeah, okay, that will be better, I think. I'm going to allow this just just because it's playing on my mind with the, with how it looks. Yeah, like that needs to be connected there somehow. I'm going to allow that. I may change uh, and fix it, make it look a bit better. That's that's actually okay. Yeah, that's okay. That's that's fine. We're going to leave that one. Uh, I will chuck in some more residential there because people are kind of screaming out for it. You can have have that. You can have all of that and that. Okay, cool. Uh, same goes for in here. You can actually have your homes up in here. Okay. I'm going to leave that road. And you can have this. Oh, that's the school up in here. I actually might... Um, oh, you can have that. I'm actually going to dezone that bit there. Because that's the actual school there. So I might actually take that out too. Because that is all school, and we'll do something special with that. Alright, you guys kind of have to move out of there, although I could move your house. They're nice homes, actually. Could move your homes to be like here. Right, um, I'm just going to move you over here. Although, are we going to get uh, are we going to get the old age old thing where it's uh, you can actually sort of be on the corner there like that, right? Just sort of set back. Uh, are we going to get the age old thing where you can be on that corner? Actually, you're going to be better here, I think. I don't mind you guys being down in this street. I'll leave you here, okay? I I will allow it for the moment. You'll probably disappear though. But I did want to keep this kind Maybe I'll fence off that up that way around the school. Uh, but I want to leave some room in here for potentially some park area. Yeah. Okay, cool. Right, the rain's really, <laughs> the rain's really not helping, is it? The rain should be putting out this fire. There's a fire. Josh, if you're watching, there's a fire. Right, uh, how are these guys going? Garbage reserves. Does that mean we can empty this empty building into another facility? Does that mean it will empty into that? Re uh, recycles it into products. Uh, have we got the fireys, Danny? Oh yeah, the fireys are here. Quick response time. Lovely. How are we doing for uh, everything? We need more commercial and stuff. Uh, do we have buses yet? We do have transport. Right, let's get a high school in, get some educated workers in, then we'll worry about a transport system, hey? That sounds pretty good. Uh, we're gonna go with that. Look, now we've got... We've got high-capacity elementary school. That's 416 a week. 
We've got uh, art, just a high school, which is 560. What's the difference between this high? A large elementary school where children go to get educated, ideal for busy neighborhoods with uh, many families. High capacity elementary, it's cheaper to run. High school education teenagers prepare them to become educated workers. Education is a requirement for buildings to level up. High capacity high school. That one's more expensive. Why is that one cheaper? That's a high capacity elementary school, Ham. Okay, well, we're just going to go with the high school, okay? Uh, where are we going to go with the high school? Probably on this side of town. I mean, it could sit here. No, this is all for healthcare stuff. We've got the primary school out there. If we have it sitting up in here, and then we can have shops and stuff in the background, because what uh, teenager doesn't love to finish school and then go to the local shops and hang out um, with their friends after school, you know? Okay, so we are... I didn't want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I did not want to do that. Uh, and I don't want to delete you, so we'll just have to move you around at the end. How about, give me the curve you in. I am going to, this time, we've got some flat land up here. I really wish this rain would go away. I'm going to put a cut in here until the rain's gone. Right, so after waiting and waiting and fast forwarding and waiting, I could not get the the rain to go away. I ended up having to go into um, uh, oh, we've got a fire now. I ended up having to go into um, dynamic weather and just turning it off because uh, it was just taking too long. So if you ever want to know, uh, you just go into options, gameplay, uh, and dynamic weather somewhere here. Where are we? Here, dynamic weather. You can turn it off, right? Uh, it's it's nice to have rain now and then, and I can probably turn it back on later, but. When you're trying to make a video and do stuff and it's just rain, 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 that's just, I know, it's just no good. <laughs> it's just no good. Right, okay, let's get uh, a road in here if we can, please. I'm going to have you come off that way. And I'm going to have you come down this way, but I'm going to get you shifted. Like that. And like that. Now I'm going to have this closed off the back here so you can't actually get there. I'm actually okay with you being at a bit of a right angle there. I'm, I don't mind that. However, this road here... Right, that's not the best road, but we know that we can work a little bit of magic with it by shifting it like that. Now, I don't mind shifting this road. It's getting sort of shifted underneath there, and you're not really going to see it, so I'm okay with that. And then what we can do with this road, oh, people are already using it, is we'll, uh, we'll just get our little um, node thingy here that we, we do. One, no, I don't want that, do I? I want, um, uh, which one did I want to get? This one. Yeah, that one, uh, all the way to there. Do I want to do it to there? I probably only want to do it to there. So there to there. Uh, to there, to there. Can I get, can I, oh no, it's going to want me to do a third one, isn't it? Yeah, to get the slope, the median. Uh, uh, mm, no, that's no good. Okay, in the end I got what I want. I basically extended it up to here and we've got a nice long run up there now. Uh, which is okay, it's fine. It, it'll, it'll be fine. Okay, <laughs> it's all going to be fine. It's a little bit hit and miss when you play with these mods and stuff sometimes and how, how to get them to work. Especially, like, uh, for me, because uh, I don't use them all, all the time. What are you doing here, game? Can I, uh, what's going on here? I want that. There we go. I don't know what was going on there. Right, I'm going to have you. I'll just get in the car park like Okay, I don't know why you decided to go down. I've obviously got a setting that's not right. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Why are we 3 MR9 minus 6? I don't want that. Uh, 
Uh, what are you? Your toggle collision. Toggle node snap. Toggle anarchy. Toggle the anarchy off for a moment just to see what you can give me. Ah, that's better. Okay. Right, now I can get what I want a little bit. So let's go like from here. Down along here. Okay, nice. We'll keep our car park flat this time, I think. Uh, I don't think it should be that long either, should it? We probably only need it that big. We'll go with the smaller car park as well this time. Okay, I'm actually going to leave um, a bit of room for footpathing down the side there. And I think that'll do it for the car park up in here. And then what we'll do, right, we'll get our little driveway section. We might even just make the driveway, although that's level there, isn't it? Maybe an entrance through the middle. Ah, this is probably going to look a little bit better and nicer. Okay, yeah, this is going to work much better for us. I want you to do that for me. I want you to shorten that right up. I don't know why it has to be like that, but it just is. Okay. Okay, and then you're going to... That's fine. We're going to extend you out to there. And then you're just going to... Well, you can come out to here too. Because you can come right to that edge. Because that is just a sort of dead end area. I'm okay with that. Yeah, yeah. What, what I'm not okay with is... This chongus bit here like that. Like those bits. But hey, I guess if that's the way into the car park. That's the way into the car park. We can deal with it. Right, give me some lines like that. regular on that side what we'll do is we'll get some um, we'll get some chart we'll get uh, some disabled ones over here right same with there uh, no actually we'll go the electric charge ones now like uh, that actually that didn't quite work uh, uh, they're okay they're kind of half crossed over each other but it is what it is and then some regular then over here, is it um, shift? No, what's my button to um, control X? There we go. Uh, we'll put them there, but I will go disabled ones here again. And some disabled ones down the end here, I think, too. But we'll go to, uh, well, no, we'll just keep it electric. That's got it working better. Okay, that's all electric. And then just regular all the way down yeah okay groovy and the other good thing is they shouldn't float now <laughs> they should not float right but you can have um, I'll take this please I'll put this in like that all right then I'll take it down here Actually, I'll take it to there. And up the back there. So we've got a nice big footpath that works up that side. We'll get another footpath here. And another one around the back here. Like that. So they all connect. We can go there. That's what I want there. Thank you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice, nice, nice. All that's connected. Get me some footpath up here. Right. The best thing about this move it tool is the fact that you literally can just bosh something in roughly and get it exactly where you want it after and make it look nice, you know. That's actually not too bad there. Just sort of squish it up there. And look at that. We've got people parking in here now. Uh, also, people not floating while they park. So, with that little uh, section done there, we're going to put the high school up over here. We got there in the end. Just a regular high school, please. We're going to 
Um, I'm going to put it like that. However, I'm going to move it to be. Maybe it should be over there. Shut up, Wesley. Apologies for that. <laughs> no one has to shut up, especially if your name's Wesley. Uh, only if you're on Star Trek as uh, as Crusher, Mr. Crusher. Right, that we're gonna sit like that. How do you want to do this? Two ways we could do it, right? We can bring a road up from here, which I probably will. And we can bring a little road tucked in down here, which we probably could too. It doesn't matter that it sits next to the main road. Because we'll fence off that main road there, okay? So give me some road here now. Uh, have we got anything like... Not really, I've only got this. Right. Okay, and then... It's going to muck up my pretty road, isn't it? I'll be honest, Ham, it is. It is going to muck up the pretty road. Getting a bridge over there would be nice. What if... What if... You don't really like that, do you? Space already exists. Turn Anarchy on. Turn Anarchy on. And then you can get what you want. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I want. Cool. Turn that back to that. Turn Anarchy back to that. Get that. Okay, I don't know why you want to hook up like that. That's how I want you to go. Right, so that's the high school in there. Let's start getting it connected up properly. It probably could do with a proper car park section out the side here, which we might do. I don't mind you having a slight... Well, actually, that looks a little bit better, I'll be honest. In fact, that looks a heck of a lot better. You're going to twizzle around this way to straighten up. Also, are cars and things okay under there? Oh, just, but... I don't like it. Uh, can we take that point? Let's get another node here. It's all a bit of a fiddle sometimes, isn't it? When you're trying to, um... When you're just trying to get things nice, we're going to go page down there. I don't mind that it sits a bit more like that. And the other thing is, just everyone avert your ears just for a sec. Shut up, shut up, shut up, wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> and this one can come up too. Shut up, Wesley. I'd rather come up a bit more. That's got me feeling a little bit happier. That bridge, they're both bridges are quite low. We c I might even move that road down lower later on, but for now, it's totally fine. Right, so uh, are we going to get a connection up to here? Or I don't really want a connection there, I'll be honest. Because uh, I don't even know if I'm going to put in a little split side section there as well. Probably not. Then we will get our little tool here again. We'll make sure it's set on that one. We'll go from like here to here. Fix that nicely. Right. Don't worry about the footpath. People can walk up and down slopes. That's totally fine. The road looks quite nice there. And we can just blow that out of touch. Make it give it a nice sort of like loop de loop. Loop de loop? Yeah, you know what I mean. Maybe don't be. 
Uh, and then get our little node thingy here. Fix that. Right. Uh, yeah, fix it like that. Open up that corner a little bit more. It's a little bit odd that it's such a skinny little bridge, but I'll, I'll take it. Okay, I can clean that all up later. But basically, we have a we have a school. We're now going to start to get educated workers, which is really good to, for our city to go forward. Uh, now we we look like we've got a little bit of a maze network going in here. I tend to think of it as in, yes, it is like that, but once you get it decorated up like this, it starts to really. Um, really start to look good. Alright, uh, I want to get in. Apologies for Hank in the background there. He's just being vocal uh, for the people out on the street. He likes that. That's his thing. He's allowed to, he's allowed to be vocal sometimes. I'm not going to put stuff right on the roundabout. I'm not going to put stuff in this road. I... Probably gonna leave most of that actually. I'll have the building there. But what I want to do is I actually I'm gonna make it so it's actually connected over to here. So uh, I'm actually gonna spin you so you're that way. Uh, I'm gonna make you historical, but I, <laughs> I'm gonna have to do the shut up, shut up, shut the up, shut up Wesley. Wesley button again. And then I can bring you down a touch. Just to keep you nice and level with what we're doing up here. Right. And I probably want you in there, to be honest, like that. Okay. That's fine. And this one, same thing. I want you over here. Although... Can you sit there like that? Can I put you there, right? Hey, that's what I was after. And now I can get another sort of... Oops. Didn't mean to spin you like that, buddy. Oh, now I'm spinning the wrong one. Yeah, that's more what I'm after. You, you come up in here like that. Yeah, so I, because I keep moving these nice square buildings... Uh, I don't even mind if you're slightly down the hill a little bit. Hopefully we can get another one up in here. Yes, so another one should hopefully pop up in there. And then, um... I need that. I was like, why can't I grab that? You spin around too. They're all the same, same buildings, but I kind of don't mind it. It makes it look like it's part of the one precinct. Right, and then uh, what I'll do is I'll make all these historical. Because I like having these old, sort of timey looking square buildings in this industrial area. Right, and then we get a nice little look like that. Oh, I think that's lovely. We can even go ahead and uh, lock these buildings in. The only trouble is, if they tend to go abandoned, that's what happens. So, we get a... We get a how, I might try and just... I might turn the symbols off so we don't have the abandoned symbol there and leave the building abandoned. I still think that's kind of cool. Uh, but if too many of them become abandon, uh, abandoned, I will take them off historical. But for the moment, they should be okay. Yeah, I I, I like it. I like these little uh, areas we're building up here. I might even put my, my own um, ploppable buildings in there as well. Alright, so we've really got a nice little area here fleshed out. We've got the school going on now. Uh, we will... We've got more park stuff we can put in too. We've got the buses we've got to start putting in as well. What fence is that? That's a park fence. Yeah, so that will go along like that. Right. Like that. 
and like that. Right, that just sort of saves things there. We've got a cul-de-sac at the end here. Really, uh, one's streets like this. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Crikeys. Streets like this where we're, um, actually you can come back to there. Yeah, streets like this where we are looking to make a feature out of it, like it's a school. So, what do you do with a school? Well, you give it a bit of a feature. Let's go 190. Uh, might be a little bit big, but I think you'll be okay. We can stretch you out just a touch here, like that. Pull you back that way. It looks a little... <laughs> it looks a little big. <laughs> yeah, just a little bit. Take it down to like that. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Uh, and then we'll put a car park out there and stuff as well. You get what I mean though? We'll sort of finish off uh, streets like that. There was a house on fire. Like, uh, like, much like that. Right, S residential wants, wants more. They want more. Residential wants more. Parklands and stuff will go in there. Let me know what you think. This is becoming a really nice little busy intersection. Now, what it means is my off-ramps and on-ramps won't be able to have the same effect through here. Well, I might be able to get something in there. We might be able to do something over the top of the graveyard. We might even sink the graveyard down lower because we're going to have to sink this whole road here lower. If you're in a Ferrari, you're okay, but this van... Okay, the van just squeaks under. Alright gang, that is the lot for today. I was going to do the overhead uh, camera shot where it follows the cars, but it, it was just, it actually picked, it picked the most boring roads to travel. It didn't pick this whole new section at all. Um, I will put in more pathing and that sort of stuff for people to jaunt along and yeah, we'll like, we'll get this place looking really nice I think. Get some potential parklands in here. Buses up next, plenty to go. Love to hear your thoughts, tips and tricks if you have them too. If you've got a better idea on how to do things as opposed to what I do and I'd love to hear it in the comment section below because that's what we're all about it's a gaming channel where we can have fun hang out everyone can uh, um, share their ideas thoughts and um, that's it stay safe wherever you are stay good to your screen get out of here <laughs>